Okay, this is my solder station. Um, we're going to be soldering at 380. This will go up to 417, reference itself, then drop down to 380. Uh, we're going to be working on uh, uh, an iPod Touch 4. Um, I've got to isolate the battery because we'll be working on the volume on-off ribbon flex cable. Um, so anyway, we're going to remove the bulk of the solder uh, from the um, uh, battery terminal. But first off, we, we need to just scratch off the, the silicon layer that's actually on there with uh, uh, a little coffee stirrer. I always collect these when I go to the coffee shop. You know, they're always a handy thing to have work around the workshop. I just see I'm using quite a wide tip. It's nice and clean. Um, so a little bit of desolder braid and I'm only going to be disconnecting one of these um, terminals here, but uh, same procedure applies if you're going to remove the whole of the battery. Anyway, just need to pry it up slightly, put it under a coffee stirrer, just to give it a little bit of pressure for lifting this up. Um, so we'll come in with a solder iron now, just hit it. Now, if you're going to do the whole lot, just Go to the next one, slide the coffee stirrer along each time, but don't put too much pressure. Now, to isolate this, I'm going to use a little bit of Captain Tape, because um, I don't want any contact on this while I'm uh, soldering. So, that's that. That should stay in place, place all right. And now we can work on the uh, volume on-off um, flex cable. So, same again, um, remove the bulk of the solder with some desolder braid and then I'm going to slice the, um, the the ribbon flex cable and then pull it up with tweezers as I'm applying a hot soldering iron. Now I'm removing this simply because it is a damaged ribbon flex cable up near the on off button. Um, so I'm just going to slice through this now with a craft knife and then lift it all off. Um, now don't worry about uh, lifting pads in this area, these are pretty uh, robust pads, but still caution applies. Anyway, the, the tendency is you'll more than likely rip the, the ribbon flex cable rather than rip um, a, a pad off the board, but just go gently with it. Um, next tutorial I'll show you how to solder all this back together again, but uh, to be quite honest, I don't think most of you will need to know because it is pretty straightforward. Don't use too much solder because you haven't got a lot of space um, to, to play with in terms of between the LCD um, uh, and whatnot. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this. Any questions, email me, uh, ring me if you want work done. Take care.